This is Dan Abbott. I am making this video for the students in my CAD management class at Southern Maine Community College regarding one of the questions on the puzzlers exam that has a new glitch that I have not seen in AutoCAD before. Um, the class that I have called CAD management uses in many cases some of the chapters from the book I wrote called AutoCAD Secrets Every User Should Know. One of those chapters is puzzling behavior that is actually normal AutoCAD behavior. It's not glitches at all, but it's things that have come up over the years. And people have called me from um, various companies and said, I can't understand what's going on here. And one of them, which was fairly common at one time, not so much now, um, has developed a new glitch in AutoCAD when you try to solve it that was not the address in the book and is not something that I would consider normal behavior. So what I'm going to do is open up a file. So at one time, if you were an old school user of AutoCAD, if you wanted to have something in a drawing that would not plot but was visible, you would put it on the def points layer because that was the only layer in AutoCAD that would not plot. Since then, it's been possible to make any layer in AutoCAD a non-plot layer. But occasionally, if you open an older drawing or you're working with somebody who's kind of old school and hasn't really um, kept up, you'll still find that people do things like put viewports on a depth points layer or something else. The problem comes with this. You open a drawing, you can't select anything. Now it seems like you probably have a locked layer. <clears throat> you come up and look at your layers, and none of those layers is locked. There's a layer that's frozen, but this can't be the problem, you think, because if those elements were on layer 0 and it was frozen, then you wouldn't be able to see anything. So you can see them, you can't select them. The problem comes from the relationship between the def points layer and layer zero. Def points were designed to hold definitions of dimensions and other anonymous blocks, but the def points layer means that you put a dimension in and then the elements that use the dimension that go to create the dimension were actually initially created on layer zero. As a result, there's a relationship between the two, which means that if you freeze layer zero, nothing on def points um, can be selected although it can be seen if you thaw it out at one time you would then be able to select items well you can't now <clears throat> it used to be if all you had to do was thaw that out so students have been puzzled by this partly because they stay in model space if you go to a layout and make one of the viewports active now you can select the objects after thawing out layer zero so you come back to model space <coughs> and um, try to do the same thing, and now it will work. Now, if you don't come back to model space, let me just undo back here. So I'm back now where I can't select anything. If I go and thaw layer zero, and then do a regen, everything disappears. That's the new glitch. Now, everything disappears in model space. If you go to layout, actually the same behavior would take place. You can't see anything. But if you regenerate the drawing, again, it comes back. So the regen process somehow hides these things, but regening again brings them back, as would saving the drawing and then opening it up again. So new glitch, those of you that are puzzled over this particular uh, question on that um, assignment, uh, because you went through this whole process, you did a regen and everything disappeared, but you weren't able to step beyond that and figure something out, that's the problem.